All right, this is a demonstration of using the Kendrick extrication device, otherwise known as the KED. Your KED is going to come in something like this. Uh, first thing to note when you're using a KED is you're first going to start with spo uh, spinal mobilization using a C-collar. And uh, I'll have, go ahead and have my partner start to hold manual stabilization, and we will apply C-collar. So once... Uh, my partner has started manual stabilization. I'll then grab my C collar, apply using the correct methods. So I'll have my partner slide out of the way and apply the C collar. At that point, I'm then going to take my head out. Make sure you have all the straps. Place the kid behind the patient, and then, if necessary, you can have your partner hold it. So go ahead and have him do that. Once the kid is in place, uh, you're going to need to follow following order for straps. You're going to go middle, bottom, legs, head, and then top. So middle strap, you bring it around the patient. The middle strap in this case is going to be the orange one or yellow, whatever you think it is. Once you place that, you're then going to tighten down. Keep in mind not to tighten too much. Uh, make sure the patient is comfortable when you put this on. Next, you're going to go to the bottom. Attach your bottom strap and pull it tight. Then from there, you're going to move on to the leg straps. The straps are going to go underneath their leg, pull it through, and then tighten. And then you're going to move on to the next one, underneath the leg, and then tighten. Now it's important to note that this is not going to be used in place of a backboard, but will be used in conjunction with it. At that point, you're going to move on to the head. So uh, in this case, we have a little bit of space behind the patient's head, so we can use the padding. We'll take it, place it, and that way the patient's neck is further supported. So we can follow by going across the patient's forehead. top strap, which is the green strap here, underneath, and tighten. Uh, now this can be used for uh, removing a patient from a car in a seated position, and you can move them onto a backboard using um, a very little motion if possible. And that is a demonstration of the kit device for uh, trauma.